Alex, okay, are you... are you back to normal? I just saw... it, it, it was like a premonition, I think, and, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I did? You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider to them. Yeah, uh, let's get this over with. You know what time it is? It's four in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually? In, uh, that situation? Uh, never leave pizza on the table. It's like getting eleven in blackjack. Just double down. Don't even think about it. You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? Like, really? Yes. Uh, undoubtedly. Without doubt. Absolutely, it's gonna work. Well, I'm glad you're confident, because I just have this feeling like these ghosts aren't really concerned. I just feel like they're pretty confident. Like they know by sunrise they're all gonna be shopping for school supplies. Jonas, don't worry about that. We don't know what they're thinking apart from the I want to live in you thing. I'll try not to worry. I think this um, stuff is getting pulled in from like their time or something this is so weird um yeah it's not exactly a good omen i think we're running out of runway here Now the station's up at the top of the hill. <sighs> I hope this works.
Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. <sighs> God, we're in another loop de loo. They always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? <sighs> yeah, they do. Thanks for the update. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. I hope this works. Yep, I am also hope that. Ren! Nona, what happened? What's wrong with Ren? Ren, he's... He had an accident. He... He died. I couldn't... Oh my god, Ren. I, I can't believe this. What happened? He... He drowned. He took a fall. I don't know. He just... He just stopped. I mean, does it really matter what happened? Either way, done is done. And done in this case is... Shut up, okay? Just shut the hell up. I don't want to... ...hear any more of your ghost garbage, all right? It isn't garbage, and we're not ghosts. Don't be rude. Alex, we know you're in charge, and we know your plan, and we also know that your plan won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A deal. A bargain, really. And you should take it. It's already over with Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence, and there's nothing you can do to change that. But, if you agree to let us take her, let her go, quietly and without fuss, you won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. We need to- Oh, no, no way! I'm saving everyone! Everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. <sighs> Courage is not always the way, dear. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Hmm? I don't care. We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we didn't provide you all the rules. He was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't. I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just. It's okay, Nona. You. You didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course, it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's. I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is. He was more important. It's not stupid. It's not small to like somebody. It doesn't... It doesn't diminish anything. <sighs> Maybe. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. And I don't know if he did. He knew, Nona. Don't worry. He knew. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. But thanks, Alex. The station's up at the top of the... Ugh. God, that was... My mouth feels like I just ate a tree. You were possessed. And for the longest time, I think that we've, um, seen so far. Yeah, I know. I can kind of remember that part. Hello? Anyone there? What? Are they... Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? 
anybody. They're both Jonas? alive. That's all I care about. Jonas, punch out so you can hear this. Yeah, no, that's a that's a bonus too. Seriously, right in the throat. Jonas, don't listen. We're all set here for the uh the thing, the machinery speak and hug or whatever we're doing. Yeah, let's do it. Times are wasted. Like, actually wasted. Like, I feel my body wasting away. No, it's it's okay if you're, like, dealing with stuff. We had to deal with stuff. What stuff? The, uh, when I almost kind of slipped and fell off the bridge. Oh my god, you guys, that... No, it was the... It was psychotic to watch. Hello, we're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello. This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist, please. Oh, thank God. I'd like to report a poltergeist. They've come into my house. They've shaved all my cats. They look better in my mittens. Oh, I just need any and all advice you can give me. Well, first... Can everyone just shut up? You can play dress-up phone time when you get home. We got work to do. Yeah, I guess he's right, actually. Okay, all right. Fine. All right, you gotta, uh, put in the call to us, like... Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Hey, we're awesome. Awesome enough, at least. Right. See you at the shelter. Over and now. Dear Mr. Jordan, couldn't we have him reborn? Jonas! Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... Are you okay now, really? Yeah, I think. It's just, um... Uh, look, it's scary, needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like... Just, like, how do I say this? Because... I don't want to... It's okay, Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. I just want to say... I just... I think it would have been cool, us living together for... For whatever. Senior year. And I'm just... Glad I met you, that's all. I'm just glad we met. <laughs> I'm... Glad, too. Okay? So, there. It's out in the open. We're both glad. Okay. Good. So, that's it. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. And we're gonna be fine, by the way. There's no... You don't have to put it like... It would have been whatever to live together. We are gonna live together, and you're someday soon gonna eat all the peanut butter, and when I go make a sandwich, I'm gonna be mad. <laughs> all right. Okay, I'm gonna. I'm just gonna say one thing, and then I promise it'll be the last time I bring it up tonight. But you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? I mean, it's not a giant thing, but still. Who's Ash? Oh, you mean Amanda? 
My really good friend Amanda, who's moving away forever. That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, because whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle the excitement. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. I don't really care about the reasons, just for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna really, um, like, commit to Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something, but you, you know what I mean. Uh, commit? What the hell does that mean? You're in high school. <laughs> I know, I know, I sound like I'm 40, but I'm just... I don't know, it's gonna be, it's not gonna be casual anymore. It's gonna be a thing, a real thing. That's all, so just get used to her. That's all I'm saying. Come on, let's get to the sentry before the last boat comes. I gotta get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just gotta write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do like work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately, this is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? So it's forced me to kind of, I don't know, and I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. Same people, the same expressions. Really? Why leave? I mean, yeah, it can suck sometimes, but it's pretty much like everywhere else. This is gonna sound weird, but everybody knows me here. I know you think I have it on easy street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? Give me a rest. You were... are great, though. And... and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well... <laughs> uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he... he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? Oh, God, Michael, I have no idea. I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Huh, that's actually, <laughs> that's not bad. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, whatever, man. Alex? Stop it. Just stop. Ugh. You got, you know, you went bad again? I couldn't get you out of it. We should really, we should get this done, now. I saw, I saw Michael again. I just, I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on, it's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's just like a trial period, like... Say anything about what? What are you guys talking about? We're dating! We're dating! Nona and I, we're gonna date! Rin! Dude! What did I just say? What? They asked! Right? You asked? Mazel tov on the happy couple! <laughs> Thank you! No, stop. It's one date, at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Romantic. Hey, one man's depressant is another chick's upper. This will not be an upper. Well, hey, on my first date with my ex, I accidentally impaled her with a pool cue. So, it's nice when there's nowhere to go but up. Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just feel like maybe it's not that insignificant or whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. <laughs> Shut up. You know what I mean. Good. I'm glad. This is... I mean, at the very least, I'll get to hear embarrassing stories, so... I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... Something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something 
broke. I don't know if it was the ghosts or whatever, but you've been acting like not you. Ren. No, I just, I don't know. Well, I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. In case things go bad and... Yeah, let's do it. We're on a beach. Kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. All right, let's take it. Alex, get in here. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So, make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. We'll be back. Oh, I know. Oof. Okay. I... Uh, all right. I am coming with you, you know. Yeah, yeah. This is that once in a lifetime